Alright, now Champion Chick is not even here. Oh boy. Alright. I just want to get stuff. Much better. Where's Champion Chick? Why is he still up there? Hey! I need one of these. Come on! I had that guy. Stop moving. You know what? Screw you. Do I have uh, any silent rounds? Subsonic. Let's see here. Silence is weapon fire. Low damage. Oh, okay, that's fine. Let's see if this works. Oh, come on. Hey there. Mike, I'm picking up fire alarms in the building. Yeah, the torch in the place. Either to erase evidence, kill me. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Dossier on Z. Sergey, my apologies I was short with you in my last email, but you must understand that Mr. Leyland has little patience for delays. But the fact of the matter is, your cooperation on this matter is not optional. Your critical 
to our efforts in Moscow. You need to keep the authorities chasing vapor trails and the weapons moving unabated. Even if you aren't on our payroll, you answer to us. I suggest you learn to like it. Vic Werner, VP of Distribution. Albrecht. can't hit this guy. Well, I'll just go attack him directly. What do we have here? Alright, champion chick. Time for you to go down. was pathetic. there. What do you intend to do now, Tom? Shoot me again? I was hoping we could talk, actually. That's all I wanted to do until you made this difficult for me. So <laughs> I do inconvenience you. It's all right. I need everything you have on Halbeck. I'm in a hurry. You. You are a terrible negotiator. Let's not make this more painful than it has to be, sir. You shoot me. Now you want me to tell you everything? <laughs> In exchange for what? I am dying. If I tell you, you will only kill me faster. Zirkov, I can still get you medical attention. And if you're not working with Halbeck, then it sounds like we can work together instead. I... I read your dossier, Tom. You're a man of your word. If bringing Halbeck down is your mission, I... I will help you. All right, lay still. I can treat some of the bleeding, but I'll need to get you to a hospital. That... that is enough for me. The records you want. The ones incriminating Halbeck. They are on my embassy workstation. Look for the encryption codes in my contact list. Under Jacob. Thank you, Sir Gov. Mina? Jacob? Call for an ambulance. Wasn't that... Local hospital. Help is on the way. His information on the encryption codes checks out, Mike. Now get out of there. Will do. Don't move, Sir Gov. I... I will not dream of it. Wasn't that what... Parker told us to look for early in the game? Strange. A 
lot of nice experience on this mission. New email. Sweet. What do we got going? Could probably buy that gun now. Hi, Mike. If there's no midget sex trafficking, there's no story. Just kidding. Readers love hearing about how big business is screwing the economy for the rest of us. This will make a good story. Thanks, Mike. Ah, another thousand bucks. Good enough for me. Mr. Leyland, I must stress once more that the Crusader artillery system must be sold. I'm not the only person on the Congressional Ways and Means Committee with a hefty share of stock in modern armaments. We're sitting on weapon systems designed for Cold War, war battles in an age of anti-insurgency. We're sitting on 50,000 obsolete mobile alt artillery platforms, and I'll be damned if they rust in storage. My assistant told me about your Jolly Roger plan, and that's a start, but we'll need more. Filling the hearts of every Euro with fear of Islamic radicals won't sell weapons of conventional war. When this is over, use your magic to brew me up a limited war. Somewhere in Turkey, Russia, Georgia, or one of those places ending in Stan. I want to see headline news show my crusader artillery platforms shelling some fools in Antolia by next Christmas. Damn it. DR. Well, we can send this to the black market. For sale documents from Henry Leland himself discussing a ways a ways? How about just ways to brew a war in Asia Minor to sell some artillery systems that are sitting in warehouses. See if you can find a buyer and send me my cut. Much appreciated. Can blackmail. Mr. Leyland, here's a fact. You have a ton of money. Here's another fact. I have incriminating information regarding your war profiteering with a certain US legislator. My demand is a simple one. Pay me not to go public with this information. You can send payments to my Credit Swiss account. The name on the account is, of course, made up, and the IP address of this email is faked. If you want this matter to disappear, I'll throw some cash at it. Doesn't that usually work for you? Scarlet, you're probably wondering, hmm, I wonder what my next exposure, expose should be about. What did I say exposure? Whatever. Um, here's a suggestion. An email between the CEO of Halbeck and a semi-anonymous U.S. legislator colluding to start a war to sell weapons. Enjoy, M. Thornton. Let's send it to Scarlet. I'm sure she'll enjoy that. 